Chuck Festival 2015, Lucy Rose, hello. Hello. How are you doing, you okay? Yeah, really good, how are you? Not too bad, thank you. Are you excited to play Chuck Festival? Yeah, really excited. I just had a look at the tent, it's, it's really kind of small, but kind of in, in the best way. Yeah, quite an intimate sort of setting intimate. in there. Yeah, they're calling it the market stage. Yeah, and it's kind of got that vibe. It's like you, you're just out on a Sunday to a nice little market and there's a little gig going on, it's kind of cool. Yeah, definitely. So, have you played Chuck Festival before? Yeah, three years ago. I think I played this exact stage, actually. Ago. Amazing. And what can people expect from your set if they've not seen you before? I don't know. I guess I guess we have a lot of fun on stage. Um, it's a lot of smiles and a lot of dancing, and you know, we play pretty hard when we can in the right songs. So yeah, it's good fun. I like the line. There's a lot of smiles. That's yeah. always good. <laughs> it's good to have. Um, so what other shows have you got lined up for the rest of summer? We've got Kendall Calling and Summer Song Festival, Reading and Leeds. My memory's terrible. <laughs> we got quite a few, I think. And out of all of those, which one do you reckon is, is the one you're most looking forward to? I know it sounds, it sounds really cheesy, but I genuinely, uh, I'm really not sure because there's so many things about each one that I'm looking forward to. Um, I guess I am looking forward to Summer Soul, just because I'll be singing with Bombay Bicycle Club again. Oh, wow, so it's just awesome. been a while, so that's always nice. And I guess each festival is different and provides its own sort of you know, uniqueness about it. But what about sort of venue gigs? Do you prefer playing in, inside a venue or do you like being out on the festivals, out on the roads? I like having toilets in a venue. <laughs> After you do like three festivals every weekend for an entire summer, it's like I don't want to see another portal. It's ever heaven again. when you get home. Yeah, it's like then just having an actual toilet before a gig is sometimes quite nice. Um, but yeah, they're both very different. So the good thing about this is there's not any pressure. I guess you don't feel the pressure as much to sell tickets and things like that because you've got such a great vast different, you know, a lot of music going on. People buy tickets and maybe stumble across you, um, but then at the same time you don't know who out those people are going to come and watch you play, so it's exactly. one of those um, And you were in the live lounge pretty recently, yeah. you did an amazing cover um, of Bad Blood. Is that going to be the last time we kind of hear that, or are you going to be dropping it into your set at any time? I don't know, I played it I played it the day after actually at Tea in the Park, um, but I wasn't really sure. It, it seemed to go down well, but the Kendrick Lamar rap, it's, it is lodged in my mind. But you, there's so you kill that, you really do kill you. that. Well, you can't really have lyrics on stage, so at Tea in the Park, I was like, I just hope I remember this. So that's the sort of one worry about doing it regularly, is I yeah. will mess up the rap, I'm sure, at some point. And I guess as well, it's about you, it's your performance and, and whatever. But do, you, do you kind of like to do other, other songs and other people's music as well? I, do, I guess I don't, I don't generally um, do any covers, I haven't. Um, that's mainly because, I guess, because I've taught myself Guitar. I don't really know yeah. what I'm doing, so if I did a cover, it would take me a long time to sort of work out yeah. what I was playing. Whereas when it's me, I can just play whatever chords sound right and write whatever I want if that makes sense. Yeah, exactly. And what's next for you? You've, you've got is the, is the album out now? Yes, the, the album came out now. last week. Amazing. Going well? Yeah, top ten. So I was really happy with that. Yeah. Amazing. And, and what's next apart from the album? Are you going to be doing any more tour dates towards the end of the year? Yeah, just lots of touring. I've already started thinking about album three and writing that to Amazing. I guess tour this one as long as I can and then hopefully put some more music out soon. Brilliant. Well, thank you for joining us. Thanks. And enjoy your Saturday Festival. Hi, I'm Lucy Rose and you can download Gig Pick.